Good morning. So this morning, I'm gonna show you how I style my hair into like a slightly different version of a slick bun. It's super easy. Same concept, essentially. You're gonna need a hairband, two elastic bobby pins, and then some type of cream, and then possibly a hairspray, depending on hair type. So the first thing I'm gonna do is just brush this out. It is super hot where I am right now, where I live. So I think it's meant to be above 30s all week. So I just wanna have it up out of my way. So the first product I'm gonna use is Super Shine Cream. They have this version in a light if you have finer hair and then if you have really fine hair, they have one called Feather Balm. So I'm just gonna work that through. Um, what I love about this is that it's like moisturizing, it adds shine. It's like my go-to product for my blow drying as well. Like this is always put into my hair. I feel like this has really helped with the condition of my hair. And I don't love always using gel. They have a really good gel that looks like this, except it's in a black tube. And Orbe is like skincare for your hair. So I find that it's like treating it while being a styling agent where lots of products are very high in alcohol, they're very drying where this has a lot of reparative properties in their line. There's just like a lot of benefits to them that I love. So I get that in there. And just really massage it into your hair. We're gonna reapply through the mid shafts and ends there once I get it into a ponytail. Now, so that's the next step is we wanna get it into a ponytail. Now I don't want it to be too high so I'm thinking around there so just like below my double crown so I'm first gonna start off with just like this is just a wet brush to get all the hair that's like deep underneath to start going the same way this is how you prevent bumps occurring And the Super Shine just allows it to like glide through quite easy as well. But you just need like a moisturizing cream. I don't want it to be drying out my hair while I'm doing this. Okay. So once I have it to the height that I want and everything's kind of in place, what I'll do then is I go in with like a bore mixed brush. So I use this little guy. He is the mini from Mason Pearson. This is a very expensive brush. You do not need this brush particularly. And what it does is it just like really polishes down that first layer, which I love. Um, they are worth the investment if you are someone that is in hairdressing A. Eh? The mini one is actually my fave because I feel like I've got a grip on it. The big one is like just a little too big for my hand, I find. I just have more control with this one. But they are pricey and you can get different versions of this. It's just, this is like the creme de la creme. If you struggle getting the buckle at the back as well, like underneath here, you need to make sure that when you're doing it, your chin is actually tilted up, hot tip. So we're just gonna get that back. And then once you have it how you want, we're gonna secure that with an elastic. So I'm now gonna just make sure I have the super shine throughout the ponytail bit. Just really work that in. Get those little ends so they don't look as dry. 
Honestly, it's like, I cannot say enough good things about this product. So we're gonna split this in two. We're gonna then split this in two. Twist. Little elastic. Twist on the ends. Yeah, you can see that shine. Look how good it looks. Same thing on the other side. I think it was trending actually where people were doing a ponytail and then doing two or three braids which was kind of like different but cute try that a different day so that's the second one so cute so i just tied it once I'm just going to start pinning that. Once you have your little squiggle, like your things done, we're just gonna So we're just going to wrap one around and like pin like the first kind of like buckle. I'm going to leave that side over. I'm going to bring the one side back over to the other side. So it's going like right to left, left to right. So it like auto wants to twist over. So we're working with that. So right to left, left to right, you're stacking it like one right under the other and the reason is is i kind of want to see the detail that's why i'm not tying them so i've seen some people like to tie them which is also so cute i just find that for like the detailing can get lost in the twist i think sometimes so i kind of want to be able to see like the little twists a little bit more So I'm just continuing to go back and forth until I'm just left with the tails. I don't want it too long, so then it went into full storage. So we're just taking those little bits, those little twists, and then pinning that in. Now the little tails, we're just tucking, tucking in and pin, okay? 
that is the tweezer in there. So I have another little tail I need to get rid of that we're going to do now. You can see I'm sticking out there. So just tuck it and pin it in. Like I kind of just squish them in underneath and then I'll pull a little bubble to make sure it's kind of like somewhat covered. down a bit and feel them. Do I? I don't know yet. Okay. Now I'm just going to get a bit of hairspray. I'm going to use the super fine by Orbe and then we're going to come back. Okay so this is the finished look. I literally just took some of the cream and like put a little bit of hairspray on to hopefully hold it throughout the day and this is the finished look. I think it's so cute like it's just like a nice little alternative to just the slick bun it's a little bit more dressy as well I think and I like that you can kind of see like there's more details in it and I feel like the shine cream just like helps accentuate this like if you have blonde hair and you did this it looks so pretty and I'm just going to work but you know we like to look cute for work too. So I think if you were going to a wedding or your wedding guest or if it's a gal's night out, super easy, super, super easy. Um, but yeah, that's all I got for you, to, for, for you guys today. Jesus, Mary and Joseph. Okay, well, that's it. I gotta go do a lot of stuff before work. So I'll see you guys later. Take care and I hope you have a fabulous day and subscribe for more. Bye.